Hey everyone, it's time to get excited, because today we're talking about Tesla's GigaPress. Why is it considered Tesla's secret weapon? Well, it's a groundbreaking technology that revolutionizes the manufacturing process of electric vehicles. No one had ever thought of using it before 2020. And until now, only Tesla has been using the GigaPress to improve how they make their most popular car, the Model Y. Today, we'll be diving deep into this incredible technology and exploring how it's changing the game for the electric vehicle industry. If you enjoy this video, be sure to hit the subscribe button and click the bell icon to be notified when we post new content. And don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you find it helpful. With that said, let's get started. The GigaPress is a type of die casting machine, which is a process that's been around for a while and is not particularly unique. For as long as cars have been around, casting has been a go-to method for making engine blocks and transmission casings. But nobody had ever thought to use it for a massive structural part of the car, until some brilliant folks at Idra, an Italian die casting machine producer, had a light bulb moment. The Idra Group, which was founded in Italy way back in 1946, is basically the gold standard for die casting technology in Europe. Even though the company was acquired by LK Technology in Hong Kong in 2008, Idra still creates, designs, and manufactures their products in Italy. They realized that as electric motors and batteries become more prevalent, old school engine blocks and cylinder heads will become obsolete. So, to stay on top of the game, they needed to supersize their casting technology and go giga. That's where they teamed up with the genius minds at Tesla and the GigaPress was born. What's super exciting about the GigaPress is that it's the product of two cool companies that are both obsessed with pushing the boundaries of innovation. There are a couple of different versions of how the idea for the GigaPress came about. According to Elon Musk, he reached out to the six largest casting machine manufacturers in the world, hoping to find a partner that could build a machine capable of casting an entire vehicle frame in one shot. Five of them turned him down, but the six, the Italian company Idra, expressed interest in the project. The general manager of Idra, Riccardo Ferrario, has his own take on the story. He says that he and his team were already working on the concept of a massive casting machine when Musk approached them, and the two companies joined forces to bring the GigaPress to life. Ferrario is a boss who lives by the words of the great Italian race car driver, Mario Andretti, if everything seems under control, you're not going fast enough. The GigaPress project was Ferrario's chance to put the pedal to the metal. Being a true Italian, he aimed to make his machine the most powerful, efficient, and sustainable casting machine in existence, while also ensuring it was a thing of beauty. And that's precisely why Idra goes the extra mile to add some flair to the GigaPress by coloring the enormous machine components and adding pops of bright red to give it a distinct, stylized appearance. Ricardo Ferrario was determined to create the ultimate casting machine, one that would be the envy of even the most prestigious car brands like Ferrari. It was a challenging task, as scaling up the casting process while maintaining a precise balance of temperature and pressure is no easy feat. But Ferrario and his team at Idro pulled it off, and the result is a machine that not only performs flawlessly, but also boasts a distinctive and eye-catching design that is instantly recognizable as the pinnacle of casting technology. The process of casting involves injecting molten aluminum at high speeds into a dime mold to create a single strong component. However, this process can be difficult to scale up because it is a delicate thermodynamic process that requires precision and high levels of pressure. The larger and more complex the mold, the greater the risk of something going wrong, such as bubbles forming in the metal or the part being incomplete and uneven. The GigaPress machine, which is about the size of a small house, contains all of these processes in one place. The process begins by liquefying solid aluminum in a melting oven at an extremely high temperature of 850 degrees Celsius or 1600 Fahrenheit. The mixture is then purified by removing aluminum oxide from the top, and the molten aluminum is held in a warming oven at 750 degrees Celsius. Here it is treated with argon gas to remove any impurities and passed through a silicon carbide filter to remove particles larger than 25 micrometers. To create a casting, the dye mold is first greased with a thin layer of soybean oil, similar to how you would grease a baking pan. The mold is then emptied of air using a vacuum, 
and metal is injected into it to form the casting. After the casting is cooled down to 400 degrees Celsius or 750 Fahrenheit, the mold is released using a clamp and a robot collects the newly casted part. The part is then submerged in a water bath to cool it down to a suitable temperature. Lastly, any extra material is removed from the casting, and it undergoes an X-ray check to ensure its quality. The significant force needed to push the molten metal through the mold leads to the generation of a substantial amount of pressure within the mold. This pressure in turn exerts a force that attempts to separate the two halves of the mold while it is being filled. Therefore, one of the key roles of the casting machine is to keep the mold intact and prevent it from coming apart under these extreme pressures. The strength of a casting machine is determined by the clamping force it can apply to the die to hold it together. This is because if the die were to break apart while casting, the molten metal inside could potentially spill out uncontrollably, resulting in a catastrophic situation. A conventional casting machine can generate up to 4,000 metric tons of clamping force, and Idra has been manufacturing machines with this level of capacity for a considerable amount of time. Now, the 6,000-ton casting machine applies 6,000 tons of force to inject the metal into the mold, which is actually far from the truth. The 6,000 tons of force refers to the level of pressure that is used to contain the molten metal inside the mold while it is being injected. This level of clamping force was first achieved by Idra with their Giga Press machine, which was a 50% improvement over their previous best. This breakthrough allowed Tesla to cast the entire front and rear sections of their Model Y frame as a single piece. Thus, the entire frame from the driver's feet forward and the entire frame from the backseat passenger's feet backward are both single castings. A new battery pack, which has bigger and stronger cells, was also designed to act as its own structural component located between the two frame castings. Idra has improved their GigaPress technology to now achieve as much as 9,000 metric tons of clamping force. The 9,000-ton GigaPress is now being utilized in Tesla's Gigafactory in Austin, Texas, to cast the rear underbody frame for the Cybertruck. So, why go through the hassle of using a powerful casting machine to construct a vehicle frame? The primary reason is efficiency, which encompasses several aspects. Typically, a vehicle frame is made up of stamped components. Stamping is a much simpler process compared to casting. It involves taking a flat sheet of metal and using a tool with a specific shape to stamp it into a desired shape. To build a frame, several dozen stamped components are welded, riveted, or glued together. The use of the Giga Press casting machine provides a more efficient way to manufacture vehicle frames compared to the traditional stamping process. With the Giga Press, the entire frame can be produced as a single, consistent part, eliminating the need to bond multiple stamped pieces together, which reduces the potential for failure and mistakes. The use of Giga Presses also saves space and reduces the number of robots required in the production line, resulting in faster production times and lower costs. Tesla's financial results show the benefits of this approach, with a high gross margin per vehicle and significant net profits. In contrast, other car manufacturers may struggle to make a profit from selling electric vehicles. Indeed, Tesla's adoption of innovative manufacturing techniques, like the Gigapress, has helped them achieve impressive production efficiency and profitability. By reducing the number of parts and potential points of failure in their vehicle frames, Tesla has been able to streamline their production processes and reduce costs. Additionally, their fast cash conversion cycle allows them to quickly turn their inventory into profits. This is in contrast to traditional automakers like Toyota and Volkswagen, which have longer cash conversion cycles and rely on more traditional manufacturing methods. That's it guys, we have just provided you some fascinating details on Tesla and the Giga Press. Now it's your turn to tell us what you think Tesla's next move might be. Will they surprise us all and cast an entire vehicle in one go? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. And while you're at it, don't miss the chance to subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell so you never miss an episode. Your support means everything and helps us reach even more curious minds out there. Thanks for tuning in, and we'll see you in the next one.